Okay, people, we're on the final part of the soup now. Yeah. So now what we're gonna do? We're gonna add our thyme in. Turn our stove off. Give you one more look. Gotta bring the camera over. Here we go. Yeah, so there you have it. Nice fish tea. Nice. See the beans, the carrot, the potato, the squash, the Chinese spinach, the dumpling. You know, everything is there. Everything, everything combined together. So you know we're going to enjoy that later. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to let this sit for a while. And then after that, I'm going to share me out a bowl and let you see what it's like. And then I'm going to enjoy it and I'm going to say bye until next time. And um, just a little slight problem earlier just now. This video for this fish tea soup, the last five minutes of it, it's going to be on two videos. I'm sorry. This is the second part of the fish tea soup. Sorry about that. Okay, blessed love, blessed love, blessed love. Give thanks and praise unto the Father, His Majesty the King, for His guidance and protection again one more time. Now Murphy's Catering Kitchen. Come to a close. Soup is all done. I know, glad you got a chance to see inside of the pot. You know, I mean, I know it wasn't all that great because, like I said, camera lady's not here today. I also have to share or save her a bowl because I know when she see the video she's going to ask where's my soup so you know anyway soup done soup smell good and soup look good so we're going to pour a bowl share out a bowl of it and oh man oh man I'm telling you I'm just going to get myself a small bowl because I'm not really ready to have a big one yet. See? Mm. Oh, yes. I'm going to enjoy this. Yes. Mm. Give you viewers another look. So there's my bowl. That's what I'm going to have now. Yeah, see that? So there you have it, another way of making fish tea soup that you can add to your recipes. And if you have never made it before, there you go, you can try it. Trust me, it is good. Even without all the spinach that I put in there and the bean, it's something good that we drink a lot of this back home. And like I made this one organic, there is no, no seasoning, salt, none of those stuff, just salt and black pepper and the squash, the carrot, the sweet potato, you know, the Chinese edo, you know, you had that inside there, you had the salt, the pepper, the beans, the garlic, mm, 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 I'm telling you. So, until next time, Murphy's Catering Kitchen come to a close. Glad I could show you another one. Like, share, subscribe, Remember to put God first in everything that you do and because without Him nothing is possible. But all things are possible through Him. So we're going to continue to love each other and always forgive. I know it's hard sometimes because sometimes some people do some real wicked things. But we have to give, forgive them and leave their judgment up unto God. He will take care of the rest. So like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget when you subscribe, hit that little bell, the notification, and you get videos every time I put them up. 
I hope you like this recipe. I hope it looks good. I will put up the recipe on the channel and you know, so forth and so forth. So until next time, peace, love, and happiness. And sorry this video came in two parts. This is the final part of the video. The full of the bigger part of the video is you will get that too. Alright, so until next time. Murphishas and Murfet. Stay good. Sorry, my bad. I'm sorry I didn't stop the video before because I know one of my subscribers would kill me. Anyway, the soup today, I started at a quarter to six, 5.45. It went on right through until five minutes to seven because I wanna make sure that I have a nice soup come together with all the stuff that I put inside of it. So there you go. And I'm glad I catch it because I wouldn't wanna lose my head, you know? Alright, so until next time, love again, peace, happiness, like, share, and subscribe.